Hey ladies, it's Taylor Elise here and I want to show you guys how I got this table to go from this to this by following Thrift Diving's tutorial here on YouTube. If you want to see how I did it, keep watching. Okay, so I started out with an unnecessary step, which was the sanding pad. Um, I decided to use the sanding pad just to see if I would be able to um, sand it down with my hands because I didn't have a sander at the time. So using this was definitely unnecessary because it only took the surface off, so. Okay, so I bought this sander today. Um, I got it from Let Go, um, or a person on Let Go, and they were selling it for $10. So this definitely made a difference. I This only took a matter of seconds. This side took me about 15 to 20 minutes to scrape and barely get anything off. So I'm working in a slow motion. This is the first time I've ever used a sander. But as you can see, it's really smooth. Um, so I'm gonna sand down the rest of it. Hopefully it'll work. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, start the sanding process. Um, I started out sanding it right in front of my doorway, but it ended up not really working out because the angle was a little weird. So I just uh, decided to um, sand it in my front yard for the rest of the time. So this is after sanding, the, sanding it down once. Um, you can see it's a little bit um, uneven and the process that you can see the circles that I have from the, are from the uh, sander. So I had my husband sand it down. And after this process, I just wiped down the um, table and I'm gonna be using the Min Wax Wood Finish uh, Jayco Bean Color and Espresso. I'm gonna mix those two together. That's what she used, so I'm just following her. So I'm brushing this down and I'm just gonna brush it with a paintbrush, a uh, simple paintbrush that I got from Lowe's, I think. And I just mixed the mixture together and I'm just painting it on really quickly. You can um, use a t-shirt, but we're wiping it off with the t-shirt. Um, it says to use, or that's what she used, is a 100% um, cotton t-shirt or a towel. Um, and after that, we decided to uh, stain it again because it wasn't as dark as we wanted it to be. Um, and then we wiped that off um, after. And so this is the process of wiping it off, just uh, wiping it off with the green. Um, you can either rub it in, some people rub the stain in, but she painted it on and then wiped it off. So that's what we're doing. Um, so as you can see, the color is very vibrant and I feel like after it settled in, it's pretty much like a really good color. So I'm using the Satin Finish Ultra White Furniture Paint, uh, spray paint on here. She used a paint on uh, paint pretty much. She used a certain brand, I don't remember what brand it was, but I decided to use Rust-Oleum because that's what I'm more comfortable with. Um, I've used the spray paint over a period of time, uh, for a long time actually. Um, so I'm very comfortable with how the it, how it turns out and how it looks. Um, and I didn't really want to paint it on, I kind of wanted it to spray it on because I felt like that was quicker. But if you want to paint it on, you can. Uh, I definitely recommend just getting like a flat um, sample paint from like your local hardware store or something like that and then just sealing it with a satin finish sealer or like a satin finish um, polyurethane or something like that. So that's what I'm using. I'm just going to be spraying it on top of the stain or top of the table. And this is how it looks after I finish spray painting it. Um, as you can see, it kind of has a shine to it because of the wood grain it has different sheen in whatever way I sanded it down. And so I'm going to put these, uh, felt pads underneath the furniture because I like to slide my furniture around and move it. I pretty much got all the tips that I got from Thrift Diving's tutorial and I felt like that was um, one of the best tutorials for the look that I was going for so I just decided to follow that and then tweak it in my own way. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and God bless.